This is too sexy. I think I'm going to go get it from her mama. I'm going to take a walk around. Body book is on for life. Don't be in a humble type. Tell me, is you now? Because I'm trying to go up tonight. Hold it, hold just left and right. I just want to live in a fantasy. I think we deserve it right. Top of the memory. I've ever made in my life. Permanent ecstasy. The ladies is pimps tonight. Living inside a dream. I slay with the love is I put that on my own mama, on my hood. I look fly, I look good. You can't touch my back, but you could. I look fly, I look too good. Put that on my. Don't forget to watch this video to the end, okay? No skips. I repeat, no skips. Put your vest on before she turn you on. And I. You guys. Good afternoon. Welcome back to the channel. Today is Saturday, October seventh. And today is self care Saturday. Okay. I have on like this all lacy ensemble. <laughs> this is too sexy. I think I'm gonna go change. Hold on. <laughs> I think this is definitely better. Okay. I don't have my shorts on, but let me quickly put that on today is saturday september 7th and i figured i have never ever showed you guys my skincare routine what is a cute fit i've never showed you guys my skincare routine or done anything on skincare lately and yeah I, it's not a lot because I really don't like to do too much with products on my face but today I want to do like a sheet collagen mask but first off this Tia this is not focusing this Tia serum is a vitamin B3 serum and it has niacinamide when i tell you baby this serum saved my life okay literally saved my life because not like my face was horrible okay i just had like really bad dark spots they were definitely worse than this but this serum has just been doing its thing Although I noticed that I have more visible pores now, I want to get something, another serum that has salicylic acid. Even though my face wash, I'm using the Snail Cos X uh, salicylic acid face wash, I want to use something more to add to that. So after that, I do like a moisturizer, right? But I'm not gonna do a moisturizer today. I'm gonna do a moisturizer after because I want to go in on this sheet mask. It's been so long, it's been ages that I use the sheet mask. So. I just want to chill today, okay? I don't want to think about anything. I don't want to stress about anything. I just want to relax and enjoy my home time as usual. This is always, this always appears to be messy, but it 
try to be careful to not bring the whole thing. I think I, I, think I did. Definitely the wrong way. <laughs> but yeah. How are you guys doing? Do you guys think I'm extra? Because I be doing this at home. Or. Oh, this is so good. I just love how it feels on my face. I definitely do love how it feels on oh, my face, okay? Um, if you have more types of sheet masks that you try, let me know in the comments but yeah so after this i'm going to go in with moisturizer and just oh this feels so good one thing about it baby i just be at home doing self-care drinking water drinking my sparkling water or not or still water and minding my business okay but I'm gonna sit down. I started watching She Must Be Obeyed yesterday, and I think I love it. Oh, this feels so good. I need to actually relax. I need to sit down and relax. But yeah. Hey, my babies. Welcome back to the channel. Today is Sunday, October 8th, and I'm all dressed up. I'm going to have brunch or dinner because it's like 4 p.m. I won't say this is brunch, but yeah, I did my makeup. What's, what am I saying? I had my hair laid myself, put some false nails. I literally looked a mess in like a few minutes ago. I just did this last minute because this outing was not planned. I'm going with Chisom. Let me show you guys the full fit. So yeah, I'm wearing this dress from one of the clothing hauls. It is from Nanama Studio. And yeah, I hope Chisom is there already. But yeah, I'm ready. Now what you wanna get is wild It was so sunny and then when I got here it looked like it was going to rain. Thank you. Thank you so much. <laughs> you guys I just got here and I just realized that Chisum was right behind me when I was driving in. <laughs> no. Um but like the aesthetic is nice and I just realized that here it used to be Zoria. But let me quickly order something. Babe, you're fucking hilarious. Me and Chisum are taking pictures. Uh, I think she wants to put Thank you It is what it is. Let's go. 
I was like, baby, when I promise, you have like cute pictures. Hey, my loves. Um, I just got back from Roco. Um, I think it is an okay restaurant. They did say they're a seven-star restaurant. I personally do not see why they would say they are, they are, that they are a seven-star restaurant. The food, I read the food. <sighs> A seven out of ten if we're being completely honest i really do not get why lagos restaurants try to like hurry people or try to like be messy like when you're taking pictures in fact I, but i am sensitive i i'm extremely polite but i'm also like sensitive because tell me why this waiter was frowning her face when i was asking her about sides like I promise you, it was not me being paranoid. You know how waiters want you to like order like the expensive stuff out of the menu. I don't have an issue with that, but if I don't want to do something, I don't want to do it. Like you can't force me. So I remember I, I had to ask her if I was like annoying her at some point because her face helped me navigate my way through the menu, especially if you guys have a shitload of stuff on your menu. So tell me why you're frowning your face, having an attitude just because I'm not bunging to order stuff that you recommend are you in my pocket are you in my wallet no you're not but yeah it wasn't bad got cute pictures got content i'm gonna go to sleep now bye see you i am headed to ibadan for grocery shopping <sighs> bruh it's 2 p.m I haven't had anything to eat as usual, but yeah, I'm beginning to find groceries, grocery shopping as an extreme sport, and my allergies are back, of course, it's allergy season, I'm having a slow Monday, I'm going to talk to you guys in the next footage. <sighs>
top of the memory I've ever made in my life Permanent ecstasy The ladies as pimps tonight Living inside a dream Let's lay where the love is like I put that on my own mama On my hood I look fly I look good You can't touch my back What you could I look Tuesday, October 10th. I like to play classic boom music. Here's a station you might like. Ultimate classical, free on Amazon Music. And I'm supposed to watch a movie. I'm supposed to watch a movie and tell me why I got to the cinema. And Mimi and her colleague already got me lit. And this is not even funny because no one's gonna believe me because they think I'm the problem, but Mimi is the problem, and it's just not fair. Anyway, we're supposed to watch Exorcist. And yeah, I was stuck in traffic for a very long time. And after that, I probably see you guys at home because I'm too late, but like, look at my. <laughs> Born and when I die 
Avenger fan, <laughs> I don't even know if this doesn't have anything to do with me being an Avenger fan or not. I just don't necessarily rush out to the cinema whenever the movie is finished. So towards the end of the movie, there was a word. When I tell you, like I needed that word in that moment, and that was so random because that was just a horror movie. If you watched Exorcist. Uh, the new exorcist, the 2023 exorcist, the part where the nun says, what do you think evil is? I don't want to be a spoiler, but at that point, she said a whole lot of stuff that made sense and doesn't just partake to the movie, but just partakes to life in general. Sorry, I'm a very deep person and I don't think in straight lines, or black and white i think in like <laughs> bro let me just not get into all that but it is saturday and today feels like sunday um i made fried rice i ate it already i watched the new um the new episode for the real housewives of lagos and i'm just catching up with vlogs and I just wanted to just with my babies I'm so happy because for once I don't have everything figured out and even though my anxiety is getting the best of me I still am taking things one day at a time the views are catching on okay and I'm slowly getting to my target for the month but I wanted to show you guys this. Do 
you guys tell me why this headband, yeah? I got, you know, you guys know the black headband that I use on top of my wigs. Um, I wanted it in other colors and I couldn't find it because I got, I usually got, what am I saying? I got this one from Ebano. Hey, is this still focusing well? I got this one from Ebano. Not this one, actually, the one I had from Ebano. And it costs just like 100 naira. But when I went to do groceries earlier in the week, I realized that it was out of stock. Oh, it's slowly getting into a trend all of a sudden. It's been trending, but I think it's trending more these days. So I had to order it online. I found it from an Instagram store called Big Vintage. So tell me why I got this for 800 Naira and that's not even the issue. I got it for 800 Naira which means the both of them is 1,600 right? And then tell me why I shipped these two headbands for 3,500 Naira. <sighs> I'm stressed. I promise you like I didn't think about it then because I thought that was the total cost of the two headbands well going back to the chat now and i'm realizing that the shipping costs more than the headband itself is it worth it really um i also wanted to show you guys these shoes i shouldn't be shopping i shouldn't have any business with shopping in this moment because life is life in right now and i have pressing bills to cater to but the reason why i got these shoes is because number one all my shoes where i keep my shoes baby like there's literally no air and i don't even remember to take it out to sunlight and most of my shoes even the expensive ones are like bad and i hate that for me but yeah i decided to look for a new place to keep my shoes for now and look at how cute these are oh orgasmic i told myself i will no longer be purchasing shoes just because it's statement of course i'm going to purchase statement pieces because <coughs> fashion girly over here but more of comfortable shoes henceforth i wanted a shoe that i could literally feel comfortable walking in all night and especially when i have events where i don't have to wear something high or i i'm struggling to i'm really struggling to explain this but yeah you get the point i wanted something that isn't high is comfortable and stylish at the same time so I opted for these. I'm going to create content around it because I don't know why I don't necessarily like unboxing videos or showing fashion items on here. But I've told myself I'm going to make a conscious effort to do that. But in the meantime, that's it. Oh, and one last thing. Hold on. Hold on. You guys, hold on. What you're not going to do is act like you didn't see that blue tick, baby. <laughs> okay. I'm, like I promise you, the blue tick, we already know the blue tick isn't the blue tick as we know it because now there is better. Better is obviously like the option of paying $14 monthly to be verified because what i'm not going to do is come on here and pretend like i'm verified like i did the whole process thing while i could because um all it takes is three uh, magazines or article publishings of which i do have those i don't even know why i never applied but baby who likes stress okay all i did was pay for it so yeah I thought about it. I didn't like the concept of paying for it in the first place, but as a creator and someone who 
whose first forte should be priority, I decided to pay for it because, yeah, why not? Priority access here. So, yeah. It is indeed a very beautiful day today. Okay? So, um, thank you for watching. Thank you for constantly being here. Thank you for the views. Yeah. Just wanted to just for my babies. And, yeah. I will see you guys soon. Don't forget to watch this video to the end, okay? No skips. I repeat. No skips. I really should remind you guys every day about that. No skips. Okay?